Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier and in my this particular video, I am going to show you black hat transformation in image processing. So what is that? Before going to definition, just check this code. Okay, I will be discussing the uh, trans about the transformation, black hat transformation after showing you the output for this particular code. So CLC clear or close or warning off as, I, as we write. If you want, you can ignore warning off line also, no issue in that. Then A equal to RGB to gray, IM read general dot JPG. Here I have taken one image. Let me just show you using IM show A. If I run this particular part of the code, evaluate selection, I'll be having one J. Okay. Now what I am doing, let me just remove this. I am taking the structuring element of disk of size radius 10. And then I am performing closing operation. So what is closing operation? As you know, dilation followed by erosion. So if you perform closing operation, what will happen? Small, small holes or black spots will be basically closed okay, by the object. And generally we consider white part as object, black part as background. Then I am plotting that subplot 1, 2, 1. I am show A, title original image, subplot 1, 2, 2. I am show ES, which is our image after performing closing operation. So let me just show you up to this particular part. And I want to ask you one question. What is the outcome if we perform closing operation in this? Obviously, if the structure is large enough, what will happen? This particular circle and the main body of J will merge. Okay, that is this particular black part will be removed. These two will be closed. Apart from that, we can see here, if you consider this domain and this one, they are in this particular part also, there is some separation. So what will happen due to performing uh, Im image closing, this particular part will be somewhat enclosed. Similarly, as here also corner is appearing, this particular part will be also somewhat enclosed. And same goes for here. Here also as these two particular part are separated by this black region. So here also somewhat by some amount, this will be enclosed. Let us check the output. Control A, evaluate selection. See, as I have told you in our intuition theory part, that is, see, all those parts, parts are merged according to our idea. That is, see, this part, this part, this part, and this part, okay? And we are getting this closed J format, okay? There is no holes or black spots are present in our original object. Now, just try to think, if I want to highlight the dark objects in white background, understand the statement properly, dark objects in white background I want to highlight, what I will do with this particular output image. So first of all, we need to understand what are the dark regions in white background. See, generally in image processing, we take background as dark and object as white. All right, we know this. But suppose at some image processing at particular case, you need to highlight the, uh, the dark objects which are situated in white background. Then if you consider this particular J image, see dark object in white background considered can be considered this one. This separation in between this circle and main body by this particular black spot can be considered as dark object in white background. Okay. Similarly, this small region, okay, you can consider that white as background for this particular small region and the dark one is the original object. Same goes for here. You can consider this small island part as object and the background is white. Same goes for here, okay. This particular small black region you can consider as original object as this is surrounded by white background. Okay. So if I want to expect this small, small parts that is dark objects, in the white background or bright background. What we can do? Very simple. We can subtract this original image from my closed form of image because if we subtract what will happen, this dark object which is basically joined in this particular closed format will be remaining as it is and rest all the part due to subtraction. What will happen? All will be zero intensity level and zero intensity level means dark. And as a result, what we will be getting? Our resultant image Basically, we'll have dark objects in white background. Those will be highlighted. Simple. So just I will be subtracting my original image from this and 
this is called black top hat transformation okay image after performing black top hat transformation that's all now see the beauty if i run this particular part of the code what i will be get, getting as expected see this is our original image and this is output of black top hat transformation see white background and black object is here this particular separation see that part is highlighted as white color here in this small region black part you can consider as your original uh, object and white as background so that particular part is highlighted similarly here this small corner here this is highlighted and this small island which you can consider as object and white as background then this part is also highlighted so see this is the beauty of black top hat transformation where if you want if you require some, in some image processing particular scenario particular case study you require to highlight only those parts which are basically dark objects black objects okay a little bit uh, intensity levels are uh, closer towards zero and if you want to highlight those and uh, those obviously are placed in the white or tighter background then you can apply that perfect transformation and you can get your result right so this is what about the new concept now let's see some fun related to image processing concept which i have discussed earlier so that we will have one recapitulation session also like for example noise reduction using morphological operation remember i have told you what we can do simple i can use im open because it will uh, uh, perform erosion followed by dilation so erosion will not fit the small uh, noisy spots and if we perform again dilation then the object will uh, reset to original uh, size so as a result the small parts will be removed but uh, keeping the rest of the part as same so if i write i am show a i'll be having this particular output and you can see in this image see there are these particular noisy parts are present which are basically these white pixels okay we want to remove this so what we will be doing we will be performing erosion so as a result these small parts will not fit in our, in our structuring element and we need to keep the size such that it will fit in our original structure and as a result due to erosion these small parts will be removed because those will not fit but our original part will also be uh, compressed or become smaller due to performing erosion so we will be again performing dilation that is erosion followed by dilation that is nothing but image opening so i have taken our structuring elements as one square matrix of 5 cross 5 then i am open a comma g a is our original image we are passing uh, the structuring element as second argument through our function i am open you or otherwise you can perform erosion first and then dilation that is two step process also okay all right and then showing the original image and then the uh, image after performing uh, here this will be opening operation okay now if i run this particular part see how beautifully it is working and uh, this particular output image don't have those noise okay so this is just one uh, recapitulation of our previous video concept one more uh, example on image closing i can show you i have taken one image where some small holes are present in our original image let's check those okay so if you check this one see there are these small black spots or holes are present in our original structure but we want to remove that so removing means what we want to fill this by white spots that means closing these are opened actually these black spots are disconnecting our original object so we will close that so we can perform i am close that is for dilation followed by erosion right i have already discussed so i am close structuring element same as earlier i have taken then original image and then image after performing closing operation just my intention uh, just the examples i am showing because my intention is you can apply the image processing concepts whatever i am discussing in various fields okay so i am trying to give as much examples as possible okay you can see in the output image all the uh, holes are basically removed okay they are closed okay and we are getting our beautiful j structure okay so i hope the black top hat transformation concept is clear to you you can apply this powerful image processing concept in your project and these are two examples of image closing and image opening operation as i have discussed earlier also 
so i hope the concepts are clear to you the all the codes will be present in the description box if you want you can check there and if you find this video helpful please like share and comment subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed till now and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos thank you for watching